you guys are too kind. Oh, stop, stop. Thank you, thank you. Hello, my name is Jacob, and today we will be cooking with Chef. And today we will be making my famous egg and cheese omelet burritos. And here we have a nice setup. And we're gonna start with basically just getting your old ordinary eggs. I like to get mine from Trader Joe's. Support the environment, you know, stuff like that. You gotta crack them. Yeah, I'll show you, I'll show you here. You gotta look for blood spots. Throw those eggs in there. I like to make four egg omelets, but you could do three if you don't want all those eggs. For me, I'm a big egg fan, so I do four. And then, once you have your egg, Top. You can get anything to stir them. Alright, so now I have this about just mixed up. Should look something like this. A nice golden yellow. And then, once you have your eggs nice and nice and mixed up, you just pour it into the pan. You should hear that nice sizzling sound that everybody loves. And the best thing about an omelet is if you mess it up, it's still fine. It just becomes cheesy scrambled eggs, which is just as just as good, if not better. But I like to challenge myself and try to make the omelet. So you're gonna have your eggs, you know, look something like this, all the way across, all the way spread across the pan. And then you're just gonna basically take your cheese. This is Munster, my personal favorite. And then you just kind of make a line right down the middle of your cheese. Should look something like this. You should take. You should see basically a line just right down the middle of the cheese of the pan. And then while the eggs ed edges are cooking, you take your knife, or really if you have something better, that'd be great. And yeah, this is not about ready, but once you start seeing it be able to fold, you know it's just about ready. And you're gonna try to fold it from one side of the pan right over the other and make a nice omelet shape. Ah, so here you see this edge kind of forming, you know, that means soon enough I'm going to be able to flip this side over the other side. Oh, you see that? That's what we're looking for, that kind of piece right there. And then you're going to continue by just continue keeping the fold. And, oh, there it is. And then you're going to try to, oh, so see, mine's messing up a little. So then, no problem, you just turn that into cheesy scrambled eggs. It works just as fine for the recipe. And here is where things get cool. You take a pita, tortilla, whatever works. You gotta get that in there right here, you know. You see, you're gonna have to like get it in there, and you're gonna take your eggs and move them over the t over the tortilla. So the tortilla kind of is on the bottom of the pan. So I'm just gonna go like this. Take these eggs and move them right on top of the tortilla. So the tortilla can get, the, can get nice and situated under my thing. So here we go. Should work a little like this. Move your eggs on top of the tortilla. And make sure that tortilla gets nice and cozy under that pan. Oh yeah. That's looking good. Perfect. So see now the tortilla is completely underneath the eggs. The eggs are on top. And while that tortilla is getting nice and toasty, I'm going to crack one more egg to cook on the tortilla. This is a Jacob Winter special. You don't see this anywhere else in any other type, type of cooking show. But cooking with Chef, we like to get creative. And that egg's gonna cook nicely and make a nice runny yolk over the egg burrito. And while we wait for that, I'll tell you guys the secret ingredient. Cheez-Its. Cheez-Its provide, you know, if you just crunch them up, put them on top, you'll get a nice crunch. So you'll bite that nice soft burrito with, this, with a little bit of crunch on the tortilla. But the extra crunch added by the grounded Cheez-Its, perfecto. So while this is cooking, we 
we could start folding the tortilla just like that. Perfect. All right. So you see now this tortilla is going to have a nice shades of golden brown. You're going to get a nice crunch over there. And then while you fold it up, make sure all the eggs cook, in, cook inside. And yeah, it's going to just, you're going to see, see, see how that egg is getting nice and cooked, a nice runny yolk, the burrito is looking good, nice and crunchy, the eggs inside are getting some extra cook. You're going to push that down, get a little excess out of there. And yeah, so it's going to look like something like this. You leave that on there for a couple more minutes. And you have yourself a perfect egg and cheese video crush.